It's the eve of battle for Father Jacek Szczepanik, who recently joined the Friars Firefighters team. These senior brothers help make sure that the new recruit is prepared for the big day. After a training session, the firefighters return to fulfill their main vocation. My favorite reading, as for many boys in elementary school, was a book called How Wojtek Became a Firefighter. There was no opportunity to join a fire brigade for me, but finally I ended up here in Yepokolanov, where I can realize my intentions to become a firefighter. Every day there are five firefighters on duty, plus an extra one who is on constant surveillance. Brother Janusz Kulak is head of this unit, a friar with 35 years of firefighting experience. We have a lot of work because there are always different accidents each year. These range from the cat in the tree to the flooded basement and disaster relief. You can say that any accident that requires help is work for the religious firefighters unit. Just like other firefighters, the friars receive many calls, but what they face the most are fires which happen during summer and autumn periods, when the weather is dry and hot. The unit was founded by St. Maximilian Maria Kolbe in 1931, answering the need to protect wooden constructions and houses in the community and surrounding area that were prone to catching fire. Father Jacek brings us to the museum and shows us the modest but heroic beginnings of the unit. There was an incident where Brother Harubim was extinguishing a fire in the stable. At one point, hot tar fell on him, both on his helmet and habit. Theoretically, he should have been dead, but it turned out that he was just a little injured where he had no clothes or habit. And here you can see him smiling with a tar flowing on him. Today, even though they are volunteers, they still have most of the functions of the state's fire department and cover a wide region. The firefighters are on call day and night, and once they receive an alert, they have just minutes to change into their uniforms and rush to the scene. When every second counts, time is precious, as a few minutes could be the difference between life and death. Yeah, all is good, it is great. Of course, it is a start. There's so much that waits for me in the future. There are cases where people are allergic to something and dealing with complications. Therefore, they have urgently called us to remove hypnoterra insects. The nest was very small, and so it was quickly removed. Being a firefighter for us is one of the aspects of religious life and the priesthood. Each of us performs many other services. Each of us is fully prepared to embrace various professions, and the firefighter is one of the ways a very spectacular way, because it's the only one in the world that allows me to be a monk, priest and brother at the same time. Thankfully today the accident was minor, but the friars often faced deadly situations and put themselves in harm's way. But for them, it's a vocation, and they say their faith in God helps them fight the flames.
Alexei Gotowski from Poland for EWTN News In Depth.